Hey, you guys. All right. Y'all might notice something really different about the studio in this one. We are going all the way back to the beginning of this channel where we first started because I have a very special surprise for you today. Can you guess what it is? Oh my goodness, I almost wrecked something. <laughs> all right, before I wreck this puzzle, let's find out. All right, hey you guys. Who remembers this setup? I don't know if all of you have seen the original videos. Me doing this black puzzle. I have a couple surprises for you guys today. Okay, first of all, this was the very first puzzle we ever did on this channel for recording. I mean, techni technically, you could say the Disney puzzle was the first. This is the first video video. I mean, we've, we've come a long way since then, we have, in terms of like just the setup and the wheel and the content. It's so weird to think about that that was only in March. And this, like, is it, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm weirded out by the fact that the camera is way closer to me because I'm used to it being like six inches back. It's fine, it's all good. I'm just like, how did we do this back in the day? This puzzle was a beast. I think all in all, it took me close to 40 some odd hours, it was, I think. It took at way least, long. At, like, yeah. at least. That is part of the surprise. I am going to review this puzzle one more time, but I am pitting it up against one of the big fish. I am pitting it up against a Ravensburger in an attempt to justify why the heck it took me so long. Um, for those of you that don't remember, back in the day when I got my start with the Disney puzzle, it was back in the day, it was like four months ago, uh, Chez 106.1 in Ottawa gifted me with this, or cursed me, depending on how you want to look at this, uh, with this black beast to see if I could, in fact, do it. And I did, in more time than I think it should have taken me, but, but we will speak more on that in a bit. You will remember, I was missing a piece. That happens, sometimes they come in a box, missing pieces. However, I did some furniture moving around and I have found the missing piece. Oh my goodness, you can't understand how excited I am about this. If any puzzle was missing a piece, this was the one that was gonna really upset me because I put blood, sweat, and tears into this thing. And today, we get to see it completed. Woohoo! There we go. Yay! It's all here, it's all here. We found it, we found it. Yay! The beast is vanquished. It's all done. <laughs> what a relief. This puzzle was awful. I can give it to you straight. Awful, 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 awful puzzle. I can appreciate a challenge. I can. This was a beast, actually. I know what puzzle I want to pin it up against. I was just going to do any rabbit's burger puzzle, but I think I have a better way to compare this for you guys. Bring out the big, big guns. The big guns. I have not done this one for you guys on this channel yet. I have done this puzzle before. I think if I do a crit puzzle for you guys, I may get one of the different colors just so it's fair. I think they make them in the same piece count. But I have done this puzzle. Less pieces granted, this is a full thousand and this is 736. However, and I didn't time myself doing this, so I can't give you an actual hour count. But it did take me only one weekend. Fair bit of work, but I really couldn't even hazard a guess as to how long it took. But this guy, 40 hours. Where did the time go? Um, the images themselves weren't too bad. They were knocked together fairly quickly. To be left with only black in itself is bad enough. But when you're talking quality, this wiggly jiggly nonsense, it's very hard on this table, but you can kind of see crappy, crappy quality bad bad quality puzzle it it's the pieces do not have any of that soft lock anything they fit kind of sort of anywhere which is fine that's all well and good when you have a picture to work with when you're working with all black and you can literally put it anywhere you're, you're, you're like 
Okay, you're taking something hard and you're making it impossible here. Like, come on, how are you supposed to figure that out? <laughs> you gotta give some tools to work with. You gotta give me something. If you're not giving me a picture, you gotta give me a shape that fits in a singular hole, or at least less than 20. <laughs> Which kind of, in a nutshell, broke it down for this puzzle. Um, something real cool I did notice about this puzzle while I was doing it. It's basically a mirror image on diagonals. Like, this corner is relatively the same as this corner, and this piece is the same as that, and this, and that, and so on. And that's kind of how I did it. I was sort of kind of trying to match them up. It gets a little wonky in the middle here, but that helps doing these sections here. However, again, we're talking crappy quality. Something like this. This is a good puzzle. It's challenging, the shapes are weird, it's unique, but because Rabbit's Burger pieces fit as they're intended to fit, they're not wiggly jiggly, the puzzle's not fighting back, good quality puzzle. I would recommend this. If you're looking for a challenge, I would. I would not do this. I, like, I am really grateful that they gifted me with this. It was nice to have the experience and to see I haven't done a lesser quality puzzle in a really long time. I can remember a couple that I did as a kid. Ooh. <laughs> you notice right away when you can move the puzzle and the pieces, put it back in the box, donate it, get it, burn it, burn it. Don't, don't even donate it. Just burn it. Not a good puzzle. You want puzzle pieces that are going to stay where they are. Hmm? Right? Yes? Yes. You, you, you don't want to do that. No. But what is... Maybe hold up two different pieces so you, they can see the... Mm. Ha! Ah! No, we're gonna lose a piece again. Is there definitely a, a, a thickness? Um, to you know what? Actually, the thickness is kind of about the same, but it, it's just the cut quality. I think it really is. I think it's the cut because you can feel the difference in quality. Like if I if I push, I think I could bend this in half. I could mend this in half too, but it, it would take more and it, it's got a sturdy quality to it. It could even honestly be what it's made out of. Kind of like the difference between real wood and press board, um, but in puzzle piece. I don't know what this blue stuff is. It's good quality, whatever it is. Uh, this is not blue stuff. This is like... Just press paper. Paper, oh. I think, yeah. This, this is many, many layers of paper and that doesn't, that doesn't hold water, so it's just... <laughs> I can become snowball very quickly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you can tell the, the quality yeah. difference. Well, you can. And they're just cut better, too. Like, these, they actually almost have sharp edges to them, if that makes sense to you guys. Like, it, to, you could poke yourself with these. You can't poke yourself painfully with these. It's painful, it, as far as puzzle goes. I mean, it's not like a razor blade, but it's, it's there. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, you guys, do you ever want to see me do this puzzle? I'm curious. I am. Is that something that you guys would want to see me try to do? Is one of the crypt puzzles? Maybe not this one. I mean, it, let me know in the comments. Would you want to see the black one or would you prefer that I do a different color? And if so, which one? Because I think they make, I know they make a gold. I know they make a pink. I don't know if there are others. I think there might be a blue. Is there? Possibly. A, I mean, need to see a gradient one in that. In the crypt? Yeah. I, they'd probably make a gradient puzzle. I would love to do a gradient as well. Um, oh, and one of those mosaic puzzles. I, I, yeah. I, I lied. I actually have one of those. I misunderstood what that was. I have a butterfly one. I will have to do that for you guys one day very soon. But for today, that is my justification why this took 40 hours. Because me, bad quality. Bad, 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 bad. I would be interested to see, I think this was printed by Shutterfly, if it was just a one-off as possible, we all have bad days, um, it, or if this is truly everyday quality, like that that's truly how they print their puzzles, and if so, not, not <laughs> it does not get my seal of approval. Something like this though does. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you for watching, let me know what you think in the comments, and do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good night, you guys.